Hello there lads and lassies, welcome to Lumina. Now, there's a bunch of snakes on screen just now and I don't know how much of you are scared of snakes or whatever, but don't worry. Don't worry, they're not real. Okay. Now, I've been told this is an Egyptian puzzle game and I'd just like to say thank you very much to the developer for sending me a copy to check it out. So, uh, let's, uh, let's play with it for that ado. So, 14th day of a walk in the Sahara in Egypt in 1920. We departed from Abu Simbel, who went west deep into the desert, as the old map indicated. Yesterday at 4am a sandstorm awoke us, and in the chaos and dust my guide Alazard, uh, sorry, Alazred, disappeared. After walking without directions and dense winds of sand, I lost consciousness. When I awoke, the winds had settled down and I was in front of a wonder of wonders, the lost pyramid of Canafer, the mad pharaoh. I finally found it! Okay. <clears throat> Clean my throat a little bit. Use the mouse to look around. Okay. That was to move. Alright, so... So we're in the desert somewhere. So let's, uh... There's the, there's the pyramid right there. So I guess we're heading to the pyramid. Check out our armor. Oh, we're, we appear to be... A lady, perhaps? I think. Or just somebody who likes to stick their chest out a lot. Okay, could be anyone. Let's head inside. Let's have a look and see what we've got. An interesting, unusual thing. Alright, here we go. Hieroglyphs. Let's uh, move on. Oh, we've got a torch, so... 1920s uh, torch, obviously. Ooh! Ooh! I fell! I fell to my death. Oh no. What a great start to the game. <laughs> okay. Little torches uh, there. Okay. Oh, there should be a strobe warning. Oh, come on. Oh my god. So what do we have here? Yeah. Yeah, it's coffee boy. Rotate this. Okay, and try and aim for something. Okay. Beam ends. Right, okay, we're good. Yep, scorpion. Ah! Instant fire, okay. Scorpion, are you gonna show me the way? Oh my god. I didn't think I would stand on it. I'm sorry, little scorpion dude. Okay, that does nothing. Okay, let's keep moving on. The lo loading screen here. So, I'm guessing each of these are... Alright, let's open that. Okay. Uh, tab to read the scroll. So we need to make white light. At some point. So we need this light to head over here. So, if I aim at this mirror, there's another scorpion over there. Okay. We actually take it. And right, that goes over there. Okay, let's uh, rotate this around a little bit. And there. Okay, so that's good. I didn't want to stand on them, but I did. Okay, alright, so. Let's uh, head on down, head on down through the, to the other side. Interesting actually, um, puzzle game, I, I like this. I do like this. So we can make different colours of light through this. Um, right, we need, we need mirrors here. Let's take that. Oh, no. We'll take it. Go find the other ones, whatever they may be. I've clicked the place of matter. Okay. Okay. Can we aim it over here? Okay, we've aimed that there. That's cool. 
Okay, now we need to get that mirror to come through here, so we need to find another mirror. Okay, so, um, yeah, um, I, I figured this one out here. Okay, so we're, um, I like our nail polish, by the way, the outfits are awesome. Okay, light of a moon, a moon raw. Right, okay. Kind of fair, taught people to harness the light of Amun Ra. So that's something at least. But we do need that light to, to shine through here as well. So we can get this to open up. So there must be something else around here that I'm not seeing. But where? Where is the thing? Dang it, there it was. Okay. Oh my god. Okay. So, look at this one back here. And we shine this over here. Alright, so. And then this one shines through there. Like so. So which we can then put there. Okay. Just need to raise this light a little bit. Okay, and like so maybe? I don't know. Okay, and then, aha, yeah, we got it, we got it, we got it, we got it, finally, okay, can't believe that, that was insane, that was an insane puzzle, so green and red makes yellow, weird, let's translate what this says here, okay, it's bounty traveled far and wide, yet man believed it was tainted with shadow. Oh, okay. So we need to combine these two lights over here into one light. So we're going to have to find another mirror somewhere. Hmm, another translation here. Okay. This land was once fertile and green. Hmm. Alright, anyway, let's try this thing. Let's replace the mirror here. Okay. Okay, and we just here. So we get yellow light. Okay. So that works out. That worked out really well. Okay. So as a puzzle game goes, um <clears throat> It's actually not too bad. It's, it's not too shabby. It's quite interesting. Uh, you've got to hunt for your puzzles. Um, it's not not too difficult either. It's just uh, a bunch of scorpions everywhere. Uh, each light takes us to a different area. Right. Okay. It all kind of makes sense in a way. So like this red light here, what's the top here, and we need this red light to open this door here. How do we get into that door? That's the question. There's got to be a way to raise this plinth up somehow. Or maybe I'm just overthinking it. What's in here? Nothing? Okay, there's nothing in there.
Right. Can we... Can we move these? Or something? I don't know. There's got to be a way to do this. Let's put the thing down here. There's got to be a way to get this. Is it Eye of Ra? Beam's not going to go that way. Wow. Okay. Anyway. I'm going to stop for here for just now. And just say there's going to be a lot of tricky puzzles in this game. If you're into your um, ancient Egyptian style puzzles. Um, using light to open doors. Uh, and you like the scenery in it. You like the idea behind it. It's certainly something I would suggest checking out. If you're into these kind of games. I like these kind of games. I like puzzle games. I like having to look around and search stuff. Sometimes however... It's like, I need some time to to properly get into the game, if you know what I mean. I, I, I prefer to play these games by myself rather than stream them. I know a lot of people do like to stream these types of games to show people what to do, but I prefer to play them on my own, at my own pace. And I don't know if you're the same or not. Let me know in the comments below what kind of games you're into that are puzzle games like this. Anyway, I'll catch you guys next time. Link in the description below as to where you can find us. But until then, bye bye.